Hey guys, what is going on? So, the long story short that of what you guys need to know, Easy PvP is actually currently down for me. I haven't been able to connect without getting error messages for about four or five days. And I've the few people that I've talked to that have tried connecting as well have said they've gotten the same error as well. So I have no clue what's up with Easy PvP. It's still in beta. So of course no one's playing. That being said, if you watch my last video, which I'm sorry about not up uploading that much, but with Easy PvP being down for me, and I don't want to, I don't want to get into any other server besides, um, I mean besides like mini game type stuff, which I don't really enjoy. Well, yeah, but that's just why I haven't really uploaded. I, I've had nothing to record when Easy, you know, as, assuming Easy PvP gets out of beta shortly, I'll have something to record then, and. The server that I talked about last video, Volantis, I talked about how they were going to announce a release date. Well, they announced it. The release date is tomorrow, May the 12th, at roughly 3 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Now, you guys, if you guys have been a long-time sub, you know my stance on this type of thing. Where they, I'm okay with where they say on this day where we are releasing the server. I'm not so okay with saying at this time on this day we're releasing a server or any other thing just because anything could go wrong and even a five minute error time like if they release it at 305 instead of three for those five minutes people are going to shit themselves it happens all the time I've seen it happen with over 20 I've seen it happen over 20 times on different Minecraft servers let it be MC PvP let it be some old like little kids type stuff. Yes, I actually remember that. Um, Fish Frog server when we had to do resets on that. Dear God, I'm going back into the memory banks now and trying to. Some of those are bringing back memories that I do not want to remember. Um, even going back to some of the Avalon maps where you know it wasn't as severe as MCPVP's seven week map reset, but I mean on Avalon it we even had a day map reset that. Took, or that took a whole day to reset. But, anyways, what you guys need to know in regards to what's going to happen on this channel, well, I'm going to try and do a Let's Play of the server. I, I'm not going to try. I intend to do a Let's Play. I'm going to try and upload, hopefully daily at first. Just, I don't know how much I actually am going to want to not one. I don't know how much I'm actually going to be able to record with it actually being somewhat entertaining or interesting. Because, if you don't know, the Volantis map is 15k by 15k. So that's 15,000 blocks each way. That is a massive map. And there are... There are going to be some homes you can set if you're donor, which I probably will be. Uh, when it's all said and done, you get multiple homes, so... But, the thing that stood out to me, there's really no spawn. They said that there is no set spawn location that you can go to. That I, when you die, you will, of course, respawn at a spawn, but you, you cannot type slash spawn and go to where you... Re God, that got confusing fast. You cannot go to slash spawn without dying. The only way to get to spawn is to die. That's the easiest way to explain it. That being said, like I said, back on track, back on topic, what to expect from this channel, I'm going to try and do some daily uploads at first, It because what the first couple episodes will probably be will be me actually traveling out to the location. Uh, they released a dine map of the uh, server, of the server map itself, and, you know, I've looked at it, and I've looked around, and I think I found the location that I want to uh, attempt to make some stuff. Now, I do plan to just live in the wild. I don't intend to join a town at all. Uh, I just don't really, I, I don't know why, it's kind of ironic that I don't like towny servers and all that, but I play on one, towny faction, whatever you want to call it. Uh, just one of those like I don't even I don't even know what this server's classified as a uh, county it's a towny server but
but it uses the factions plugin because Towny is stupid and refuses to work with certain plugins. With roleplay and PvP, etc., etc. Now, what I hope is to happen, as I've said a couple times now, I the first couple days, the first well, the first couple days in regards to uploading, not first couple days of my actual playtime. First couple days of uh, when after the server gets released, I will upload a couple videos of me traveling out. It will probably be. If I had to guess, two or three videos, because it is a pretty long travel time, uh, or block distance from where the spawn is, where you're going to spawn into the server. But, I don't know how much of that actually is going to be entertaining, so I might do some uh, cuts and edits of it. So it could be one video, could be three videos, could be a couple videos. After that, I will basically go into full Let's Play mode, where... It's just me building stuff, me talking about what I want to do, me planning out stuff. Uh, I'll probably do some little cuts and edits if I have to go, you know, mine cobble for a couple hours or go chop wood forever. Unless I have something interesting to talk about, then I will, of course, include it. What I hope to get done on that server is I want to build my own town. Now, I do not want it to actually be via the faction plugin, though. I want to build a wilderness town. I've done that on nearly every single server that has allowed wilderness building. And the thing to note is that griefing is illegal. But stealing is legal. It is allowed. But if you have to grief blocks to, to steal an item, then that is considered griefing. So if I put blocks above my chest to, to protect them, you cannot break them and steal from them. It will be rolled back and the a person that actually does it will be punished. In some way or another, probably jail or something like that. In-game jail. Not... God, that's stupid. Um, but, of course, if the chest is just wide open, no blocks protecting it, then... Yeah, come, come on in, go wild. You can steal everything. Just If you have to, if you have to bl break any blocks to get into the area you will not be able to steal. I hope that makes sense. So, guys, I will throw the website uh, URL in the description. I will throw the IP in the description. And hopefully I see some of you guys online on the server. I'm hoping at least some of you are going to plan on watching all the Let's Plays. I know that a ton of my subscribers are extremely inactive. I know at least half of them actually aren't real subs. Someone recently admitted, well, long story short on that is about two years ago, someone told me they were they, they were going to sub bot me, and I told them not to, but they kind of didn't like me, so I didn't really understand the reasoning behind it, but I guess I understand the reasoning now, because they gave me somewhere in the Somewhere in the realm of 2,000 subs through the sub bot in, which makes this channel look even more inactive as it is in regards to views and comments per video compared to sub numbers, of course, etc., etc. So, you know, I would start a new channel and all that, but I honestly don't want to go through all that work and all that trouble and you know all that and I and I like this channel name I don't want to lose the channel name I want to stick with this I saw the creation of this channel I'm going to see the death of this channel but I hope the death isn't for a long while even though it's slowly on life support already ladies and gentlemen I will see you sometime Tuesday probably Tuesday evening early Wednesday morning depending on my upload speed but expect the first video then, and probably a video each day after that, excluding the weekends. I don't know how I'm going to upload in regards to that. I'll talk to you later, and peace out.